Hayashi rice or hashed beef rice hayashiraisu is a dish popular in Japan as a Western-style dish yashoku. It usually contains beef, onions, and button mushrooms, in a thick demi-glass sauce which often contains red wine and tomato sauce. This sauce is served atop or alongside steamed rice. The sauce is sometimes topped with a drizzle of fresh cream. The dish originates from the former mining town of Akuno, Hyogo Prefecture, Japan. There was a French engineer who worked for the mine in 1868 and improved it. Hayashi rice has a Western influence with the use of demi-glass and often red wine, but is unknown in Western countries. In fact, it contains ingredients popular in Japan, slices of beef Hyogo Prefecture is also famous for its Kobe beef, rice and demi-glass sauce, among others. It can be compared to another popular dish, the Japanese-style hamburger steak with demi-glass sauce. Another variation is the omahayashi, a combination of omaris and hayashi rice. It also resembles a Japanese curry and usually appears on menus alongside curry. There is some debate regarding the origin of the name of this dish. One belief is that the name was given by Yuteki Hayashi, Zhao Shi Shi Yuda Hayashi Yuteki, the first president of publishing company Maruzan Wan Shan Ya. Wan Shan Shang Song Day. Another theory is that the name was produced by a cook named Hayashi who often served this dish for staff meals at the Ueno Seiyokan Shangyi Jing Yang Zan restaurant. Perhaps the most common explanation is that the name Hayashi hashed is simply derived from the English phrase hashed beef. Hayashi rice is one of Japan's most popular western style dishes. Thanks to the widespread availability of Hayashi rice mix normally sold as roux blocks and prepared demi-glace sauce normally canned at Japanese supermarkets, this dish is common household fare. Like Japanese curry, it is usually eaten with a spoon. Hayashi rice was an important dish in mystery writer Keigo Higashino's novel Ryusei no Kazuna. See also Demi-glass Japanese curry Beef bourguignon